Welcome guys, welcome back to City Skylines Industries episode 13. Yes, it's episode 13 of City Skylines Industries. So I do have on the random disasters. I would have to change the frequency of those disasters because I actually have it set to high from one of my last City Skyline streams. But for now, let's just prepare for those disasters in the city. Thank you guys for all the support and everything on the channel. Feel free to drop a like and a subscribe if you like my content and want to see more City Skylines on the channel. I know I may be sounding a bit weird. <laughs> Got a problem with my voice today. And we seem to be having some traffic issues as usual. We are right now sitting on a population. Wow, this is so. I'm just adjust this crazy wonky looking junction here. Right. Still a bit high, but twenty two prisoners in our prison. Mm, my voice is messed up today. All right, so the traffic manager. Right, so that was causing the traffic down here. The junction. As you can see, some move it. Alright guys, let's get into preparing the city for some disasters. Yeah, this fire coverage on here is terrible. And also up here, so let's just see if we can get one of we got to prepare for the disasters. And the building collapsed. Yeah, fire service up there. Let me 
adjust the frequency of as you see guys I can buy the full set of tiles and also I change my resolution finally it took me a while to find out what was the issue why the recording was a little smaller than usual yeah disasters frequency not so high but like average center yes blood on Right, so no more annoying notifications when I'm far away. All right. Let's just prepare for disasters. few small ones around the areas most of the areas here would start to level up due to the new for here, as this is a big district, we we'll drop that. Hopefully, we can get a random disaster during the course of this episode. If not next episode. is a bit too steep there yeah problem I'm having is with the hills it's really hard to put in one of these so it's really hard I just got one there That's a curve road, it's really hard to get anything on that road. So you can get one right here. Yep. I got a small one. And for that in right there. I may not cover the whole thing, but. Yeah, my voice is literally sounding extremely deep, like, wow. That's awkward. And you can put one right here just to finish cover up that area. On the shoot. Some people would be moving out. 
I was up on the random weather or dynamic dynamic weather as it states. So many oil district there. On there. That's a metro station. Why is that line disconnected? I'll have to check on why that line is showing disconnected. Right, and we got one huge one across. The slope is too steep. Across here. We'd have to put some buses for those. These guys here must have one. Mm -hmm. Trying to get it to fit. On the main road. So that I get more coverage. So this. Holy smokes. This is gonna be so hard. Alright. Got that there. Now we also have to drop some of these down. Preparing for disasters. That would adjust itself eventually. That covers most of that hill. Oh, I can get one right there. And one right there. Oh, one might as well go right here. And right here. And then one. Smack dab in the middle of there. Right. Now just to make sure these guys have power. Yep, that one has power. This one doesn't. Right, now he does. And neither does this one. No, he does. This one has... This one does not. I'm trying to remember where I actually placed them. Oh, there's that one there, one here, those guys have, oh, right. Water is still good. Garbage is good, uh, moderately. As the transport of the garbage trucks are uh, annoying. Boo -doo -boo -doo -boo -doo -doo. 
the coverage is good. Oh, no, we forgot to spot the other mine. I forgot this area down here. Let's see, we can get it there. Right now, back to the repair, and we need sensors. So, drop some very quick sensors. I don't think these need power. If I remember correctly. And that covers all my populated areas. Yeah, the space station can do that one. Do you have any... Well, they see us right here, so we can't possibly get tsunamis. I'll drop a few of those. Thunderstorms. Possible. And that. So now we're partially prepared for any disaster that decides to try and hit us. Alright, and we're almost out of money. <laughs> that took a lot of money to actually get that up and running but we uh, we are still in the positive in regards to that yeah traffic manager Let's deal with this traffic. Yeah. to make that. Right, and this one should be able to choose 
what lane he wants to go in. Why these guys have to stick in the lane they're already in. guys so yeah just took a while to sort out the bit of traffic managing in the roundabout there as you can see it's flowing a bit smoother but not as smooth as wanted but it's flowing good enough for the cars to be moving along as this is an industrial district as for T skies here, mm, they're still going. They're all right. Just have a major garbage issue in the city. Somehow the garbage trucks are not gotten to where they should be. Especially on this piece of hill here. It's like really... Not working out for these guys on this hill. I think one thing major self it. Having a road for an emergency road connecting those two. Now we've got to use traffic manager and vehicle restrictions. This road. Move, please. And no, 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 no. Buses, no. No cars. Only those. Alright. It's done. People are actually using it to cross also, so. That's good. There's zone and I'm worrying about. That should allow more garbage trucks to actually use that. Where is he going? Yeah, like you obviously would not have access to a garbage truck. Why the hell are you there? Why is that building a zone there? Like that's... That's very weird zone in the corner there. Some crazy zoning. Really crazy. Really, really crazy zoning there. Okay. 
All right, so we have some six citizens in the city. All right, we clearly did not get any disasters this episode, but probably next episode we'd have a bit of disasters in our city and see how we can handle that set of disasters in the city. Alright guys, thank you for tuning in to the 13th episode of City Skylines Industries. It's been uh, an interesting series on the channel. As you know, I'm known for City Skylines on the channel and also other indie games and simulator games. If you guys want to catch my City Skylines or see more city skylines on the channel feel free to drop a like and a subscribe to the video don't forget to click on the bell icon yes guys my voice is sounding extremely weird today i have a bit of a cold so i'm not talking as loud as usual and in the tone that i usually talk in sorry about that anyway guys thank you for tuning in thank you for all the support on the channel that that there looks very weird thank you for all the support on the channel so far hope you guys enjoy this episode don't forget to drop a like and subscribe to the video and click on the bell icon to get notified when city skylines and other videos go live for you also guys just to notify you guys as you guys may have known if you have seen the episodes i am currently doing a Ghost Recon Wildlands playthrough on the channel so feel free to check out that video should be on screen about now and also Factorio is on a pause due to the recent updates with the game just have to get the save files back up and running and we'll be back to Factorio so hopefully next week we would see Factorio back on the channel anyway guys thank you for tuning in to this episode of City Skylines Industries episode 13 feel free to drop a like and subscribe to the video don't forget to click on the bell icon to get notified when I go live see you guys on Twitch and on YouTube thank you guys all the links in the description below